Now, the proceeds realized are from the 21st National Women Conference of the Committee of Wives of Lagos of Officials, CULSA, will be tailored towards sponsoring a school project. Wife of the Lagos State Governor and Chairman of uh, the Committee, Ibija Kesawolu, said this at a news briefing to mark the start of the annual conference in Lagos. Correspondent Love Ekukoyedoko reports. <laughs> All is now set for the hybrid event. Dr. Ibijokesa Wonlu disclosed that proceeds from the previous conferences were used to build recreational centers with about 10 centers built so far and managed by the Ministry of Youth, Sports and Social Development. This time I said we were interested in going the educational route. And so for educational route, we're looking at partnering with Ministry of Education in ensuring that we have good coverage of schools in Lagos State. The area we're looking at this time around is under Ibile, we're looking at Ekwe Division. That is where we're looking at this time around. We realize that we have quite a number of our children in the rural setting. Some of them only have access to primary, junior secondary, and then they have to travel long distances to go for the senior secondary. She said some women who have distinguished themselves and made positive impacts will be honored as inspirational women of the year in line with the tradition. For the first time, there will also be the inspirational use of the year category. And I think it's about time that, apart from just looking at the women, we should also look at the youths. We have done our research and we have realized like the theme of this year is saying, awake. It's time for us to awake women. And so in line with that, we realize that we have been giving the awards to our women, and it's time that we start looking at the youths, the youths of tomorrow. It's important. They're going to take over from us. Nigeria's First Lady Aisha Muhammad Buhari is scheduled to declare the conference open while Ondo State Governor Rotimi Akiridulu is to serve her special guest of honor at the opening ceremony, and the Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseki will be the special guest of honor at the closing ceremony. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Uyedukun, reporting for Plus TV, Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.